Hey, welcome back to Ramsey Land. Today I want to demonstrate the strength of atmospheric pressure. Check this out. For this demonstration, I'm going to use a har bottle and a balloon. So what makes a har bottle unique is that it has this cork on one end. So if I try to blow into the har bottle while the cork is there, it just builds up pressure. But if I remove the cork, then I can pass this rod all the way through the bottle. So there's an opening on both ends. Now I can blow air through the bottle. The next step is to take a balloon and simply put it into the bottle and wrap the neck of the balloon around the outside of the bottle. So the balloon is inside, but it's not inflated yet. Now I can blow up the balloon because the air that's in the bottle can escape out the end. But if I use this cork, I can keep the balloon inflated inside the bottle, even though the neck of the balloon is open. Check this out. By putting the cork in the end, the balloon stays inflated. How is that possible? I can easily see the inside of the balloon. I can even pass this rod inside of it, and the air doesn't come out. Why doesn't the air come out of the balloon? Why doesn't it deflate? How is it possible that the balloon stays inflated? Think about air pressure. A lot of us forget that there's 14.7 pounds per inch of air pressure acting against us since the day we're born. And that air pressure is acting against this balloon. There's so much more pressure outside this balloon that's keeping the air inside of it, that's keeping the balloon inflated, than the pressure inside the balloon. And that's why the balloon stays inflated, because of all the atmospheric pressure on the outside of the balloon. Another fun way to demonstrate air pressure is by taking your har bottle and actually putting water inside the balloon. Check it out, you can see that water in there. Isn't that amazing? I add a little more. What do you think will happen if we remove the cork? What will happen to all that water? Will the balloon stay inflated? Or will the water shoot out? Let's find out. I think I should do this demonstration over the sink. Watch what happens to the water in the balloon when I remove the cork. Oh, it shot out. Another great way to demonstrate air pressure is just with a flask and a ping pong ball. Fill it all the way to the brim, put your ping pong ball on top, hold your finger over the flask and slowly turn it upside down. Check it out. None of the water falls out of the flask. You can turn it sideways and the water won't fall out because all the air outside the flask has more pressure than the water inside the flask. Look at that. I can even shake it and that water is not coming out. Atmospheric pressure in Ramsey land. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's edition of Ramsey land and I'll see you next time.